Welcome back behind the velvet rope. Let's just get right into it today because we are with Miss Sarah Frazier. Oh my God, David. Sorry. I'm noshing on some bare apple chips. It's a little ASMR for our listeners or a complete annoyance because when I chewed gum that one time, people were like, tell her to get the gum out of her mouth. She's a professional. I, I remember that. I remember they were not happy with you. We just talk. So we, you know, we have so much insight. Um, I get hungry. I get it. Now, mind you, you know, if I, I say to you not to eat, they'll say I'm being rude to you because that's what some dumb motherfucker keeps saying. So to that motherfucker, I say I have 10, I have 10 inches fucking kneel down and suck it, bitch. Okay. I mean, seriously, keep your fucking comments to yourself. They fall they don't fall on deaf ears, but they do because nothing will change. So suck my dick. <laughs> um, there, <laughs> there you go. Like, I'm being mean, and I don't even <laughs> realize. It's <laughs> some form of customer service. <laughs> I'm being Zero. mean, and, like I don't even <laughs> realize. Yeah, now listen, this is not. Oh my God. This is not as you told me. It's show business. It's not your friends. This is not show. <laughs> um, request of the week. Okay, this is our show. <laughs> So your comments will not change anything. I just sat down. I have the pleasure of sitting down for a second oh time God. with the icon comedian Ooh. that is Judy Gold. Great comedian. Yes. She's like, if you don't like what I have to say on stage, shut the fuck up. Get the fuck out of the audience and stop fucking listening. So to everyone who doesn't like what I'm saying, I don't give a fuck. Not even one. <laughs> Sarah, like literally, I don't even you give a like, to suck your dentist. <laughs> sorry. I don't think you can. Sorry. I, 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 sorry. I'm not even paying attention. I'm literally, I'm literally no, doing I, something I, I else at the same time. Like, fuck, I, I, I don't care. I think it's fine now. And you know, people have so many choices. So I always say to people, if I eat something else. Eat, Fine. And, you know, people do this to me too now all the time. And they, they come for, I don't know if they come for you too. I know they do, you know, but people go, oh, I see you follow, you know, I don't know, some conservative or I see you. Oh, you liberal. People always make it political now. They always, oh, I, oh, Jordan Peters. I see you, you follow Jordan Peterson. He's this, he's that. Unfollow me. I don't care. I've like, been telling I, every. I don't care. I, I don't care anymore. Like I used to, I used no, to. No, like, don't care. Oh my God, am I you know, am I because they're transphobic or by the way, he's not transphobic. He said this like a million times, but people label him as that. So two oh things God, get to I... be true. And by the way, I've been telling everyone off because like I'll post like, you know, we just talked about recently. I don't know what we talked. We talked about Kelly and Rick or something. So someone will respond and they'll be like, yeah, that's they'll be true. like Kelly Dodd, MAGA. And I'm like, and I respond like, I'm not commenting on my politics, but I'm like, doesn't Kelly, first of all, Kelly should come back on this show right away because I defend her all the time. I'm like, Kelly can vote, Kelly can vote for whoever she fucking wants. That is how the world works. Everyone can support whoever that. So I'm just like, I'm, I'm getting mad for Kelly. Not even, I'm, it's always about politics. I'm not even inserting myself yeah. in this political argument. I'm like, Kelly can vote for whoever she fucking wants, as could everybody listening to the show in any country that they are. So well, I, I'm can, like you, and I'm like, if you don't like my her. response, fuck off, unfollow. Yeah, people, people write that about me too. Why are you following? <sighs> oh God. You follow whoever you want. You follow whatever conservative you want. You're entitled. You're a fucking human being. And guess what, everybody? Well, I like to see what other people have to say on all sides. I mean, uh, you know, but it's it's just, it's amazing. It's like, I don't know, it, what drives me nuts is like the audience, not all, because most of our fans are awesome. So I, I hate that we, I yeah, we I do. focusing on our good yeah. fans. But it just, it's like, they almost feel like they got you when they, they write. Yes, you. Like, that's why I, You yes. follow Kelly Dodd, that Matt, and I'm like, you think you've got the gut and like, get the fuck off. I don't care. You know, that's I when I tell them me by yes. saying like, oh, I follow Jordan Peterson. Go fuck yourself. You think this matter? Like it, go try to get somebody you think could be gotten. Like I don't, it's so crazy. They always feel like they've got you. Like that's when I tell them to fuck off. That's exactly it. When they're like, huh? Ooh, he loves Sutton and Rinna and he's not happy with Garcelle's behavior last night. Hmm. It's like, oh, you think you got me? Okay, bitch, just call it out. You're saying I'm racist, but guess what? Yeah, I do have a fucking problem with Garcelle's behavior last night. Guess what? Kelly's MAGA MAGA. I love, I respond. I love Kelly Dodd. Right. It's the same thing. It's like, when you think you got me, I'm like, gotten, gotten, guilty as charged. Unfollow me. 
Yeah. It's like I'm they're like, trying. I'm tenant. like, it's oh, too. wait, I'm not implying you are. You are. You're be honest. You this is what you're trying yeah, just to say imply. It. This is what you're and, implying. Th- and then I say, I'm like, I FYI. I have, in, in, I have something to say. Your attempt to cancel me has been canceled. That's like officially my line. Your attempt to cancel me has been canceled. So, but I do agree. Most of our fans are great, but right. God, and guess what? Whatever you think you're going to get me on, you've got me. Yeah, I admit it. I admit Stupid. all of it. I am not going to be Melissa Gorga in 13 years that says that I came on the show and Teresa knew I was coming on. And all of a sudden, we're going to realize Teresa never knew. And I've been lying to you. For- no, there's no lies here. Just ask. Just ask, sweetie. I got nothing to hide. You don't like it? Move on along. Go clean your asshole out down the fucking street. Um. Okay. Okay, but shout out to everyone that loves us <laughs> because there's way more love. There's yes, way more love. yes. You guys, most everybody loves us. Just awesome. every now and then, one motherfucker. But most of you guys love us and we love you. We're not fake. That's why you love us. Um, Where? 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 I know where you are. Oh, can we start with something happy? Oh, yes, I guess it's yes, happy. yes. Let's shift it to something happy. Yes. Everyone is in Paris where they were a few weeks ago, for two weeks ago yes. for Fashion Week. So- I don't know if you saw this too. Sutton was just with LVP in Paris. Okay. They okay. had a dinner. I mean, Sutton's in I did. For, Sutton's for Pat, you know. And then so Rena. So shady, so messy. So maybe Rena is right. Remember when Rena said, like, let like Garcelle and Sutton, this is a challenge for you guys to be real and be as messy as you are. I mean, Sutton knew what she was doing posting that LVP pick. Messy. I'm like, oh, it's about to be a good season of Beverly Hills. Well, every time, and I know Oliver works for Lisa, but every time Garcelle and Lisa, listen, you and I would do the same thing. If I'm going to dinner with LVP, I'm posted a picture. Like, this is just the world we live in. Like, yeah, you know that this one picture, and even if they run into each other, like, you know, look, why would you not post a pic that could incite so many people just for snapping the camera. And like, for all we know, they ran into each other. I don't know if it was an actual dinner. I couldn't didn't really, but like, who cares? Like that one picture will get, you know, Kyle riled up if, you know. Oh, everybody do it. it. Do it. Yeah, Kyle, do it. Yeah. Um, You know, Erica, J- EJ, you know, I don't even know if EJ had a relationship with LVP prior, but you know. She's I don't thinking- think she's the, such a fan of LVPs now. No. No, well, Erica says, you know, she even said when she was walking after she said Rinna was the goat, she's like, I give, Ke- yes, I give Kathy credit. Like she showed up and faced it. She's like, she could have run away like a pussy bitch, like LVP. That's Erica. Erica's very much like show up and deal with it. Cause look what I've had to deal with. So she's basically said like, she doesn't like LVP because she didn't show up at the reunion. You think that photo though made LVP look desperate? Does it, does it seem desperate from LVP's point of view? It doesn't from Sutton's cause it was just a good, you know, it was a, Touche, you know, it was a play by Sutton. But what what do you 